Hi everybody, this is Susanna from collegemapper.com and this is a special Corona College Counseling video about the AP test this year in May of 2020. So we didn't know what the College Board was going to do, but here's what they've done. They've reduced the size, the length of the AP test. They're now 45 minutes only, only covering material you guys have learned up to March before everything changed. And they are going to be online tests taken at home, postponed by one week. So the test dates are May 11th to May 22nd this year. And you can take free online AP classes on their YouTube channel, the College Board AP YouTube channel, totally free. Go for it, do it. Um, while there are a lot of varying opinions about the College Board in general and the AP test move that they made this year, I do think it gives you guys structure and a goal and something to work forward, you know, work for and to look forward to doing. So go for it you know, put your head down and take this test, some structure. That's really good right now. It's gonna be a free response question test only, no multiple choice, which also means no cheating because it's an essay test. And they've built in anti-cheating measures that you can read about on their website. They're still working through even more of those. This is an open book and an open note test. And as a veteran dedicated student, I can say to you, that means you need to be organized. You have to have your notes and everything just so organized color-coded, ready to go, laid out. You can't be looking for anything during an open book, open note test. You have to be ready to go. It's got to be laid out and organized, okay? So do that beforehand. Um, this is also a situation where you can still get a fee waiver if that's been a problem for you. You know, make sure that you talk to your school counselor to, to pay for the test. Don't let money stand in the way of your education ever. If you have accommodations in place at school, 504 IEP extended time, talk to your school counselor. You should be getting those on the AP test just the same. And they, the College Board will publish format guides and prep videos for these on their website, so be checking that. The number one thing you need to do is prepare your testing area and your family. Number one thing after studying. So the number two thing you need to do, prepare your area. Make sure you have everything. Computer, phone, iPad, charger, charged up the night before. Someone's taking care of the dog. There's a plan about what's going to happen with the baby brother. Nobody else will be on the internet because you have gone over this very politely with them the night before at dinner. Make a family plan about the quiet time that you need and publish the schedule to the family let them know the exact time of the test and exactly what you need and have everybody on board and eat a nice protein breakfast no sugar um, so just be ready and practice and if you have any more questions post them in the forum on collegemapper.com I just posted a huge blog post about this and our phone app is coming next month in May take care kid and good luck